The Hopkinton Area Land Trust hosted their annual meeting at the HCAM studios. Barry Rosenblum explained what the land trust is about. The land trust is, um, when we were established in 1994 with the charter, it was to assist in acquiring and maintaining Hopkinton's open space and conservation land. It's interesting, it's a standalone corporation. It's not an entity related to the town government. It was formed by five residents of Hopkinton. It's a federal nonprofit and a state nonprofit corporation. And everybody on the board are volunteers. All of the labor and energy that goes into maintaining this trust and its responsibilities are done on volunteer hours from the nine of us and some supported by about eight other land steward volunteers. Um, the budget is funded purely through membership dues and donations that we get annually. Okay. A, a short excerpt, I've highlighted the main emphasis from the trust mission statement. The trust is formed to preserve, maintain, and conserve land in Hopkinton, in the boundaries of this town. Also, we take on a role of educating the public. We have a new website now that we hope will, will uh, really lead that effort a bit further. And we'll refer more people to it with some educational material. We also facilitate the use um, and encourage land conservation in talking to homeowners, developers, and working with the town. And that's our primary mission in life. Some of the many accomplishments of the Hopkinton Area Land Trust were highlighted during the meeting. A thousand acres of open space has, is now owned by the trust in fee or under conservation restrictions on the land. There's over 15 miles of trails that are actively used by the community. We've applied for 17 grants We've, we've won 16 of them to help fund projects on, the, on this land that we're responsible for. We've also installed a geocaching program, which we'll talk about a bit further in the presentation. And we've also increased trust awareness through newsletters, efforts and articles, and events. So that's a high level summary of the past 24 years. They also recognized an Eagle Scout who helped renovate one of the trails in Hopkinton. Uh, um, yeah, sure. What were the highlights for you? So, um, yeah, it was a it was a, a tough project. Um, we had to. There was a lot of debris, metal debris that we had to clear, especially barbed wire on the trail. That was tough, but um, we were able to get through it. A lot of volunteers. I want to t thank uh, Troop One in Hopkinton. There were a lot of scouts there. Um, my troop. Uh, who volunteered and helped me get through the project, and especially um, Halt, um, and especially Mr. Ferber, uh, was a big help in planning the project and getting the work done. And as for members of my troop uh, that I especially want to thank, my Eagle Scout coach, um, Mr. Kimball, uh, he uh, did a great job in assisting me in planning the whole project and helping to, to see it through with me um, if I had any questions. Um, and my scoutmaster, Mr. Packer, uh, was also a great guiding force, and as well as Mr. Dion and Mr. Haskins, who are a few some parents in the troop that were especially helpful. You can see the full meeting airing on HCAM or at our YouTube page or our website, HCAM.TV.